Bog and Shook! <laughs> <laughs> and we're back with another semi-live report from Bug and Shook Kids News! Today, we are taking a look at the extensive window displays that have been set up around New York for the holidays. Every year, the stores go all out to create the greatest displays ever. And they range from the traditional to the futuristic to the bizarre. <laughs> I'll say they are. Some of them are strange enough to help out Blanche Dubois. And that's quite strange, folks. Now, it doesn't mean they are bad, as things that are different can be quite wonderful. Take Boog, for example. <laughs> Thanks, I think. Let's start our tour off with Macy's, who do a traditional and a more modern display each year. Behind me, you see scenes inspired by the story, Yes, Virginia, There is a Santa Claus. This story came from a newspaper article way back in 1897. That's old. Maybe as old as your parents. Maybe even as your grandparents. If you don't know the story, there have been movies and cartoons made out of it. Plus, it's about Santa, and it can't hurt to watch a movie about the big guy to show your support. Facing Herald Square, Macy's has their more modern windows. In these amazing scenes, you can see Santa's workshop. A giant interactive pinball machine. Santa and Mrs. Claus dancing to the music of a player piano. And even a magical outdoor scene. Next, we travel to Lord & Taylor, where they turn some construction into an amazing lighted canopy. In their windows, they created an outstanding scenes of animals frolicking in a winter wonderland. Check out the bear playing with the mice. These silly raccoons. Squirrel skating. And even the owls getting in on the holiday activity. Now we move further uptown to Saks Fifth Avenue, which is so close to Rockefeller Center that you can see the famous Christmas tree in the distance. This year, Saks created the Land of a Thousand Delights and filled their windows with beautiful displays showing the Nutcracker Sweet. That's sweet like candy and I want to eat it all! Yes, Bug, you are correct. There is lots of candy in these windows. These scenes are full of candy and cakes and nutcrackers. A little bit of everything delicious. But don't look at them for too long or you might need a trip to the dentist. Finally, we head even further uptown in New York, past Tiffany and Company's amazing outside decorations. Shug, I'm hungry. Want to go get some breakfast? Not yet, bug. Hmm. Near Tiffany, we find ourselves at Bergdorf Goodman. Their theme is Destination Extraordinary, and it sure is. Check out the detail in these displays. Wow, monkeys! And a giant rabbit. These displays are getting more and more unusual. Yes, they are, Bug. And that brings us to our second to last stop, a place known for its most unusual window displays every year. Barney's has worked with artists and designers to create these wonders. You won't be disappointed when you visit these windows, as they will give you tons to talk about. Finally, we wrap up our report. You can see some of the beautiful work done in the windows at Bloomingdale's. These windows are gorgeous, and you can just stand and stare at all the colors. Okay, that does it for this report, folks. Thanks for watching. Good night, folks. Shug! Now can we go get some breakfast at Tiffany's? They don't serve breakfast, Bug. They don't? Then what was that movie about? Good night, folks. Stupid Hollywood. <laughs> that was great! Oh, that was awesome, Bug! Hey, everybody, be sure to subscribe by pressing that circle with our faces on it. Yeah, and after you subscribe, click on the rectangle to go to the next amazing Bug and Shook video! What a great idea! Yay! Yay!